Hi everyone, Darren here and this time we're looking at a road marking paint sprayer. Now in front of me is the Titan Powerliner 4955. Now it's got several features that have been uh, worked on by Titan over the years and in this case they've got a new trademark customized arm and this is fully customizable depending on what height you want the spray guns to be from the uh, road surface and also maybe the distance from the sprayer and also the spray guns themselves because you'll see in fact we've got two spray guns attached to the paint sprayer. Because there's two spray guns uh, attached that means that in fact this paint sprayer can take two paint hoses. If you're using uh, one paint spray gun you've got a maximum spray tip size of 33 thousandths of an inch and if you're attaching two spray guns then that maximum spray tip size drops down to 25 thousandths of an inch. If we move towards the handlebars, this control station has a pressure gauge. It has a place for you to adjust the pressure, which is quite fantastic for when you're working with the pen sprayer. You can stand behind the unit, you're holding onto the handlebars, and you're able to very easily adjust the pressure. So you don't have to move away from the back of the machine to the front and be adjusting the pressure at some other place. And you're also able to see the pressure readouts right in front of you. Now the handlebars, it's a deadlock system, meaning that you can adjust the handlebars to a certain position that you like, and then it gets locked together. And this uh, provides a very strong stability when moving the paint sprayer, but also gives you some customization since we're not all different heights, and some of us might prefer to have the handlebars set a bit further away or further forward. And this is kind of given more of an ergonomic feel because if you're working with this uh, sprayer for long hours you kind of want to make sure that it's it's customized to how best do you want to use it also on the control station there's a cup holder and a place for your phone so you can plug in your iphone listen to some music and just work throughout the day and titan really have thought about the user in mind uh, when designing this paint sprayer just a few more specs this is a 4.7 liter delivery rate it's a petrol driven machine and the engine is a honda 120 cc honda engine what's included in the delivery well we've got a hose whip and another hose with the paint hose which is a 15 meter hose it's a quarter inch then we you get given your uh, spray li uh, liquid, pump armor, there's uh, spray tips for when you're using the hose itself, otherwise you get a uh, 419, this is a line laser spray tip, so this is just for use when you're spray painting lines. You also can see in front of me you've got a white large hopper, but this hopper can come off and you can put a paint bucket directly on, so it gives you some versatility. There's also a brake on the front on the right hand side for the wheel so that you can lock that in place and the sprayer won't go anywhere. A few other things just that you would expect on the paint sprayer we've got a housing for the filter but in this case the paint material actually feeds into the control unit and that's why you're able to adjust the pressure setting and see the pressure readout so the material is kind of moving through the unit first and then goes out through the guns but this really does make it a very easy to use but a yet fully customizable machine. And that's it for the road marking. This is the Titan Powerliner 4955. There are a few other units available depending on exactly what requirements you may need. So there's some smaller units and there are one or two much larger units. So depending on how much material you want to spray and how frequently you're using it, maybe one of the other sprays might be more suitable. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, you can leave it in the comment section below. And as always, have a great spray.